not on birth control, so you'll have to pull out. Um, what is up, guys? It's Moxie Zombie here to show you some GTA 5 on the PS4. This game is amazing. Um, the neon on the cars is a really cool feature. Um, the car I'm driving now, um, of course, it's not the exact thing, but uh, it's supposed to be a resemblance of a car from Fast and Furious, uh, Tyrese, if you know who that is. Um, yeah, I mean, he had a blue and silver clips, and it was convertible, of course. But, uh, sorry, it's car is convertible. Um, I got close to the cut, honestly, because, of course, the UK doesn't have decals and stuff like that, so I did the best I could, did the best I could to get the paint job. So, uh, basically all I did is, I mean, it's real simple. Yeah. Of course I upgraded it, but you don't have to make it fast if you don't want to. You can just keep it like this. Um, I started off with a Galaxy Blue, a metallic Galaxy Blue, and then I mixed in uh, pearlescent silver for the primary color. And then the top you see there, that is also Galaxy Blue. So, I mean, you can't really see it because the light's not shining on it. Even if the light shines on it, you can't really see it. But uh, it's about the color of it. Um, the wheels are as bad as I can get them. I mean, I tried to go for as many sides as the real car had in the movie. Um, like I said, there's no real, like there's no real dead on car that looks like, you know. Um, spoiler, everything, the neon looks about the same it would look on uh, the movies, you know. Um, this is one of my cars, so let me go back to my garage, and I will show you guys. So, yeah, hold on a minute. Um, I'm drive around. Uh, I'm new to Twitch, if anyone's watching, which as of now I cannot see, but, uh, if anyone's watching, just, you know, slap that like button, uh, follow me, whatever. You know, don't be afraid to comment in the video, don't be shy. No discrimination, you know, all people welcome. And, even if you do comment, just try not to be, they like, don't be mean, no bullying or anything, you know. We accept everybody, be nice to each other, see how you want to be treated, you know. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I'm new, just so you can tell me how I'm doing. No things, like no mean things, like, oh, well, you started to do that, like, yeah, I, I'm new. And plus, like, that's just me. I'm not going to take offense to it, but... Just, just don't post that stuff in the comments, you know, I try to keep the, I want to keep the comments positive, you know. So yeah, here's my, here's my house. I'm going to my garage real quick and uh, show you my other cars. So, as you can see, this right here across from me is the Duke, which they have added to, um... They have added this to PS4. I think they have it on PS3. Maybe. But, uh. So yeah. Um. Yeah, they have added this to GTA. I mean, uh. It's pretty cool. Uh, this is the Duke, like I said. Uh, if you paint it black, it literally will match. If you paint this black, it will literally match Dom Charger from Fast and Furious if you guys have ever seen that movie. This car is the closest I could get to Paul Walker's silver and blue Skyline GTR. Um like again, not perfect, but uh yeah. And then this is completely off, but I did the best I could. And this is supposed to resemble his um green with a blue of course I don't have decals but green with blue a blue decal uh eclipse. Um, the next car I'm working on is his RX-7, which was the orange one with the badass paint job that uh, Dom takes in the, end of the movie, if you've seen it. Um, and that one, the Voltic, is the closest to look like that, so all I have to do is really paint it orange and, I don't know, like, throw some red in there, maybe. Maybe, the, like, do an orange and red combination, you know, metallic and pearlescent. Um, but yeah, I just, just want to show you my cars, uh... Here's my other Elgi. I love this car. Too fast. It's my motorcycle. My bagger. I bought. I had one of these and I liked it. And then I got this thing. This thing is a beast. Okay, this is. If you guys, 
ever want to do missions and you want something that is dependent and can climb just about anything, I would highly recommend saving your money for the Dubsta. The Dubsta is a great vehicle. Great for off-road and great for anything, honestly. It's it's great. Um, you can paint it in the color you want. You don't have to paint it blue and red, of course. Um, but yeah, you can, seriously, it's, it's a great vehicle. I love it. But, uh, yeah, so... I guess that's it. Mm, see you guys in the next video. Bye.